Well, hello, my Cornerstone compatriots. This is Mr. Matt, and happy April 1st, or April Fool's Day, as some people like to call it, right? <laughs> yuck, yuck, yuck. All right. All righty, all righty, all righty. So today's um, story is called Keep Trying, okay? And we're going to go over the topic words on our communication board here first. The main character in this story is Narumi, this young lady right here. Alrighty. Some of the other characters in this story are Chad, Cal. Here's Chad, here's Cal. And Nick. Alrighty, let's see. Let's go over some of the topic words here. First topic word I need to go over is like. So I guess if you let's zoom in here a little bit. Okay, if you like something, you know you you like it. The sign for like is this like like the American Sign Language sign. Meat. Okay, so the next topic word is meat. Let's see if they have that. Hmm. Looks like they don't have that. The sign language ASL word for that, uh, sign for that is meat. So it's nice to meet you okay so when you meet somebody you know you like this like two people getting together you know alrighty new well when something something is shiny and new let's see if they have a word for that a picture for that oh I sure hope they do yep like this new block <laughs> it has little little shiny symbols coming from it it's all shiny and new all right let's see time ah yes that's an important word we go over time a lot a lot i have a friend in class who likes to say a lot okay let's see time 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 well it looks like they don't have a picture for time but we do know time has to do with a clock and there's a picture of an analog clock right here and we were looking at digital clocks on yesterday's lesson when we were talking about job preferences so okay let's go over some of the other topic words excited <gasps> I'm so excited about something. Okay, we have excited right here. Little stick figure. <gasps> yes, I'm so excited. When something is new, you sometimes get excited about it, you know? And let's see. Tired. Oh, so tired. You know, sometimes you get tired playing a game like soccer. That can tire you out. And let's see. Ball. All right. We use balls on the playground. This is a soccer ball. You can tell by the white and black pattern. All right. Over here. Take a break. We take breaks at school. You know, you take breaks at work. Or when you're working at a trial job. With Miss Eleanor and Miss Tammy, you take a break, but you got to watch the time. You have to watch the clock when you take a break. Make sure you get back to work on time. Better. When you get better at something. All right. You know, you practice something and you get better. Like Mr. M, Mr. Matt has practiced guitar and piano and he's gotten better at over the years. You might not think I'm too good from the videos that I put out sometimes. <laughs> you know, I'm not always as good as I can be, but you know, if I practice a song, I get better. <laughs> All right, let's see. Hard. When something is hard. Oh man, it's too hard. Oh, I can't lift this up. It's too heavy. 
That would be me, right? Not you. All right, let's see. Uh, teach. Well, that's what I do, right? I teach you stuff every day in class, not just your ABCs, okay? I teach you everything from time, telling time to, you know, doing small jobs, you know, like wiping tables to, um, you know, uh, now I'm drawing a blank. Money, we do money. I teach you about money and debit cards. Learn, and you guys do a good job learning. Sit there. It's interesting how they show the person learning from reading a book. There are so many different ways to learn now. You can learn on a tablet, you know, you can learn on a computer like you're learning right now. Fun. All right. It's great to have fun. And you can have fun playing a game like soccer. And it looks like in this picture, the person is score. He's making a score in soccer. Let's see. Try. Ah, that's an important word. Try. It's important to try new things, you know. Don't want to be stuck doing the same old stuff all the time, right? You know? So, you know, you might try using like a, a new digital device or something, you know, instead of the same old digital device. Right. It's nice to be right. Can't always be right. All right. Glad. And you're feeling glad. You smile. Okay. Tell. All right. It's nice to tell someone. You know, you tell people things. Hey, you know, I got a uh, a new book the other day, or I got a new video game the other day. It's awesome. You know, I tried something new the other day. I went to a museum. Okay. So when you play sports like soccer, you run and you can fall. All right. And when you're ready, you let people know you're ready. You don't have to use words. You can choose thumbs up. You ready? You bet. All right. In soccer, you kick the ball. All right. And it's important to play with your friends. You've got to take time out to play. Can't work all the time. All work and no play. Makes you a dull boy or girl. All right. And you got to have friends. Okay. It's good to have friends. But don't put your arm around your friend unless you have permission. You know, got to keep boundaries. But it's nice to have friends. Okay. On with the story. Here we go. So how many times, again, hold on a second, uh, again, the name of this story is Keep Trying, okay, Keep Trying. How many times should you try a new activity? One time and give up if you don't like it? Or more than one time so you get better at it, you know? Like when I first started playing guitar, you know, um, you know, I, I didn't just try it like one time and play like a lousy chord and go and be like, okay, or be like, ah, oh, you know, I'm not going to do this anymore. This, this is a drag. I'm just going to, you know, I just started like practicing. Whoops. <laughs> and I'm still not good. <laughs> And I got better at it over time. Okay, so let's see. So Naomi, no, I'm sorry, Narumi, in this first picture, she looks a little frustrated, you know? Maybe she fell down and she's not very good at soccer, okay? But then later on, it looks like she's trying again and trying harder. 
I wonder what happens when Naomi Narumi keeps trying to play soccer. As I read, it is your job to find out what happens when Narumi keeps trying. Okay, what happens when Narumi keeps trying? Okay, words to learn. All right. Let me zoom in a little bit here. All right. Community. All right, community. A place where people live and work together in one area. Okay. Like, you know, people live and work in one area. So, um, people, people in your neighborhood. Okay. Um, those are people uh, that you live in the same area with, you know, your neighbors and stuff. And um, you don't necessarily work together, but, you know, you live in the same area. You might work at the same place as one of your neighbors. Activity. Something a person or group does for fun. Exercise, work, or entertainment. An activity. All right. So you might read as an activity, like this guy here. You might play baseball as an activity, like this guy here. You might ride a bicycle as an activity. <laughs> and you can do all these things in a group. You know, you can even read in a group. You know, we read in a group every day, right? You can belong to a, like a book club, you know? All right, let's go to the next thing. Word search puzzle. Okay. A word search puzzle puzzle is a word search puzzle. Okay, a word search puzzle is a game for one person to find and circle hidden words. It's a leisure activity. Okay, so this is oops. This is a word search puzzle right here. <laughs> you find the word, you circle it. That's gonna be mentioned in the story. Things to learn from this story. Okay, trying. I'm gonna move this circle a little bit. Trying new activities can be hard at first. Okay, like typing, you know, typing on a keyboard. It can be hard at first, but after a while, you know, you start to get pretty good at it, you know. It is important to learn more than one, uh, more than uh, that, excuse me, it's important to try more than one time when learning a new activity. Don't just give up, okay? Learning new activities can be fun, you know? All right. Alrighty then, let's see. Narumi has many friends. You can see Narumi here, and she's thinking about her many friends. Okay. Today, one day on the calendar, they will play soccer together. Together. All right. See, now they show us the picture for together. <laughs> I couldn't find it on the uh, communication board. Maybe it's just me, you know. Narumi packs her water bottle. It's important to stay hydrated when you play sports outside, especially when it's warm or hot. Sometimes it might be too hot to play sports, so you got to be careful. And you should always wear sunblock. You know, smear the sunblock on your skin so you don't get sunburned. In fact, here's an example of sunblock right here. This says copper tone tanning, so it's a little bit, it's, you know, not as, uh, Powerful as the other SBFs, you should get a much higher SBF than this, but it kind of looks like this, you know. You know, open it up, squeeze them out, put the sunblock on, but get a higher one than 15, okay? Okay, so Narumi packs her tennis shoes. It's funny how they say tennis shoes, you know, that um, she packs her sneakers to play soccer. Right, this unique calls them tennis shoes for some reason. Narumi is excited to see her friends. All right, and she should be because it's great to see her friends. All right, and here she is on the soccer field with her buddies, her friends. All right, 
Soccer is a new activity. New activity for Narumi. Narumi listens. She uses her ear to listen to the rules. The friends are ready to play. Alrighty, let's see. Narumi cannot kick the ball. Oh, that's why she looks like that. She's having trouble kicking. She's trying to, trying to, she's running. She's trying to kick and she misses the ball. Oh, that'd be enough to make anybody not feel good. She is running a lot. Okay. She is feeling tired. Oh, she's tired. Oh. You know, I'm just really tired of running a lot and missing the ball when I kick it. Oh, and she falls, too. She falls. She needs a break. Yes, I think we'd all need a break after running and falling and trying to kick the ball and missing, you know? Makes you tired. Makes you frustrated. Ugh, frustrated, you know? Okay, let's see. Um... Narumi tells her friends soccer is hard. She does not like soccer. Chad tells Narumi to keep trying. Then Narumi will get better at soccer. Okay. So Chad tells her after trying, she'll get better. All right. And I guess trying is symbolized by this person. This little stick figure pushing that heavy ball, you know, trying to push the heavy ball and getting better at it. Well, that's nice. That's nice to her friends, encouraging her. Okay. okay I got to zoom out here. Pardon me. Okay, so Cal says he could not do word search puzzles. He's telling her he could not do word search puzzles. Then Narumi taught him how to do a, a word search puzzle. Cal kept trying until he got better. So he's reminding her of the time that she helped him. Now he's helping her. That's what friends are for. Now, Cal likes doing word search puzzles. Narumi says, you are right. You're right. Also means right. It can mean ready. Thumbs up can mean a lot of things, you know. <laughs> it's like you're eating. How's the food? You know. <laughs> oh, goodness. She will keep trying. She'll keep trying to play soccer and get better. And Rumi will get better at soccer. All right. Let's see. The friends start playing soccer again. Narumi kicks the ball to Nick. Nick kicks the ball into the goal. Goal! All right. That rocks, man. All right. Let's see. Oh, I didn't go look at that picture, did I? Yep, there she is. Kicking the ball to Nick. Nice. And Nick makes the goal. Narumi helped Nick score. Yeah. The friends cheer. Woo! Narumi is glad she kept on trying. She got better. So that can mean better too. Thumbs up. Two thumbs up for better. Better. Learning new activities is fun. Yeah, it is. Okay, now for some tips. All right. You can learn about new activities from your friends. You know? Let's see. You can get better at new activities if you keep trying. There's the symbol for trying again. Push that ball. Push that big medicine ball and keep trying to get better at something. Okay, now we're on the comprehension section to see what you remembered, you know, and see if you remember what happens when Rumi keeps trying, okay? Soccer is a 
blank activity for Narumi. What kind of activity was it for Narumi? Let's see. Was it a better activity for Narumi at first? Was it a learning activity activity for Narumi? Yeah, actually it was because she did learn how to play. Was it a new activity for Narumi? Was it a trying activity for Narumi? Was it a like a like activity for Narumi? Well, let's see. Well, we know it was a learning activity, but there's a capital L here, so that probably won't fit into the sentence too well. Let's try it anyways and see what happens. Oh, the box is already turning red, which means it's not the right word. And I accidentally put it in anyway, so let's get rid of it. All right, let's see. Soccer is... Oh, darn. Nick keeps zooming me out. Soccer is... Is it a new activity for Narumi? You bet. All right. Soccer is a new activity for Narumi. She does not blank soccer. She does not what? Let's see. Narumi does not better soccer. She does not learning soccer. Those two don't make any sense. She does not new soccer. Nope. Doesn't make any sense either. She does not trying soccer. That doesn't make any sense. She does not like soccer. Ah, that's right. At first, she doesn't like soccer. Chad tells Narumi to keep what? Let's see. Chad tells Narumi to keep better. Tell t Chad tells Narumi to keep learning. That does make sense, but again, there's that capital L, so it doesn't really fit into the sentence. Chad tells Narumi to keep new. Chad tells Narumi to keep trying. You're right. Let's keep trying. Okay, Narumi will get what at soccer? Let us see. Narumi will get what at soccer? She'll get better. She'll get learning. She'll get new at soccer. She'll get trying at soccer. She'll get a like at soccer. You're right. Narumi will get better at soccer. You rock, Narumi. Blank, act blank new activities is fun. Let's see. Learning new activities is fun. New 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 activities is fun. New 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 activities is fun. Doesn't make any sense, huh? Trying activities is fun. Trying new activities is fun. Yes, but it doesn't begin with a capital T, so you're not going to put it at the beginning of a sentence. You see? Well, that's not going to go there. Like new activities is fun. Eh, it doesn't make any sense either, huh? Learning new activities is fun. You're right, it is. I love the multiple choice section because it does not zoom zoom out on me, you know, <laughs> when I click on things. You know, so all right, here we are. What the ASL sign for what is this story about? Is it about playing cards? Is it about doing new activities? Is it about earning money? Okay, what do you think? You're right. It's about doing new activities. Woohoo! All right. How? Does Narumi feel about soccer at the beginning? Let's see. How does Narumi feel about soccer at the beginning? She does not like soccer. She loves soccer. She is afraid of soccer. 
<laughs> so what do you remember? You're right. She does not like soccer. All righty. Number three, what does Chad tell Narumi to do? Does he tell her to run faster? Does he tell her to eat more fruit? <laughs> does he tell her to keep trying? You're right. He tells, tells Chad tells her to keep trying. She'll get better at it. Okay, so what will happen if Narumi keeps trying to play soccer? Number four, what will happen if she keeps trying to play soccer? She will get better? She will make money? Well, if she gets really, really, really good at soccer, she might make money at it, you know, because I'm sure professional soccer players make pretty decent money, right? Maybe not as much as professional American football players, but, you know, <laughs> or baseball players. I don't know. She will fall asleep if she keeps playing soccer. Which one do you think it is? You're right. She will get better. Okay. And the last question. The last roundup. Eha. What? is important to know about this story, okay? Do not try new activities. Use coupons when you go shopping. That's a good thing but to do, but that's not what the story is about. Learning new activities can be fun. And what do you think the answer is? You're right. Learning new activities can be fun. All righty. Well, that's all we have time for today, Cornerstone friends. And next comes the song. Stay tuned. Okay, my Cornerstone cats, here's an old Creedence song for you. <laughs> Just about summer time, but by the courthouse they started to unwind. Four kids on the corner trying to make a buck. Fred picks a tune out and he blows another hop. Down on the corner, out in the street, Willie and the poor boys are playing, bringing their gold tabby feet. Just got a smile. Blinking thumbs to go face and his solos for a while. Poor boy twangs a rhythm on his caliber zoo. He goes to a dance and doubles on his zoo. Down on the corner, out in the street, Willie and the poor boys are playing, bringing in gold tappy feet. Just to hang around. But if you got an go won't you lay your money down? Over on the corner, there's a happy noise. People come from all around to watch the magic boys. Down on the corner, out in the street, we the poor boys playing. We can nickel tap your feet. Oh, down on the corner. Out in the street, when the poor boys playing, bring a nickel tap your feet. Thank you.